Welcome to another Beer in Front video review. Tonight I'm going to have Shiner Bach. This is one of the beers that we'll be judging for the 2022 Beer in Front Awards. This is definitely an old school classic. Shiner Bach was first brewed in 1913 and it's been a year round staple since 1973. So we're pushing almost 50 years as a year round beer. It's an independent brewery called Spotzel. It's brewed in Shiner, Texas. It's a very low alcohol beer, low IBU beer. So this is one that you could drink a lot of. I'm assuming that the fine people in Texas drink a lot of these because it's damn hot and humid there. But let's crack it open and try it. I don't know if you could tell from the video, but it's a very light brown color. I don't, I'm not getting a lot of aroma from this. I'm getting a little malt in the aroma. There's really no hops here. It only clocks in at 13 IBU, so it's not a hoppy beer at all. But yeah, the aroma is very faint to me. I'm just getting a little bit of malt. not bad. I, I had this once years ago. It might have even been 20 years ago and I wasn't a huge fan of it back then to be honest with you but as I'm sipping this now it's not bad. It has a lot of nice carbonation to it. I, I'm getting a little bit of bitterness in here so which is good. It's a little bitterness, a little malt flavor to this. Not a bad beer whatsoever. It kind of surprised me because even pouring it, you could tell not a lot of head on this, but it's more carbonated than it looks. Definitely not a bad beer. So let's give this a score here. Color, I love this color. Color, I'm giving it a 10. You know, it reminds me of the color of a Vienna Lager, which if you know me, I love Vienna Lager. So the color on this is a 10. The aroma, very faint. Uh, I have to give it a six, uh, very faint. The taste, the taste, like I said, the taste is not bad at all. I'd give the taste on this a seven. It has a nice little malty feel to it and get a little bit of bitterness towards the end. Overall, Overall, I'd, I'd give this a seven overall. The color is really good. The flavor is good. I like everything about this. I, I'd give the overall thing of Shiner Bach a seven. If you see Shiner Bach, it's available everywhere. I picked it up here in Chicago. So if I could get it in Chicago, you can get it. Made in Texas, grab yourself a Shiner Bach. 